The Italian marksman given the hero treatment by his teammates Marco Gabbiadini was the toast of the Southampton dressing room following his 72nd-minute strike gave the Saints a 1-0 win over Swansea City to almost guarantee their Premier League safety. The Italian, who came on as a substitute for the injured Jan Bednarik just four minutes earlier, scrambled home from a corner to give Southampton a three-points lead over the Swans with one game left. The goal was very much in the style of the game, a scrappy nervous affair which for long periods showed just why both teams were scrambling for their lives at the bottom of the Premier League. The win means Saints now leapfrog Huddersfield into 16th place and should assure their Premier League survival, barring a nine-goal swing with Swansea on the last day of the season. Southampton have a nine-goal superior difference to Swansea and although the Welsh club will be favourites to beat Stoke at home on Sunday whilst Southampton host champions Manchester City, it would be a massive turnaround should they get sent down on goal difference. Huddersfield Town are still not out of it, the Terriers needing one point from either of their last two games. The problem being those two games are against Chelsea away on Wednesday night and then Arsenal at home on Sunday. David Wagner's side are three points clear of Swansea in 17th position but with a worst goal difference. Two defeats for them and a win for the Swans against Stoke would see the Welsh club survive by the skin of their teeth. The win for Saints also condemned West Brom who joined Stoke as relegated this on the day that their manager Darren Moore was given the Premier League Manager of the Month award. Southampton players will enjoy tonight though if this video from their changing room is anything to go by and it would be a huge shock were they not to stay a Premier League side now. Want to read more football articles? Register with the Sportsman to personalize your news feed with your favorite sports and football team.